robot into the fight. And all that sounds all good because once again, it's to program the people to accept what seems to be good, but it's not. Because I guarantee you, say we live to see 20 more years from now, say 10, 15 more years, where now human beings are not arresting human beings. You have robots arresting you. A robot actually is putting you in. So he body slam you. Can you imagine a body slam? You complaining that you're getting a body slam from a human being. Imagine a robot body slamming you on the ground and saying to you that you're resisting. Like how they do? You're resisting. You're resisting. Now he's licensed. You can't realize what the people know that they can't really do. They will organize and centralize in a different my area in a different way how to have the people a part of wanting the poison so we want what they got we're gonna pay the price for what we want we want faster internet we want faster phones we want to do things quicker and everybody say well change is good change is good yes right but let me ask you this. Would you not want to live for 100 years than to just live only for 30? Yes. Because I guarantee you, by the time they finish centralizing and organizing their programs, their centers, their high energy voltage, their high radiation are connections that they are the tip of a button or within the state of the mind because you know it's not just about your 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 your, tele, your smart televisions your smart um refrigerator your your smart um stove it's not about that it's about you that's going to be the constant cyborg and how could the, the state of the mind could be it will come as a reality that one can look at you and create disaster. That is the technology that is going on because if everything is about, I am the original duplicate, I'm the original substance of all type of electronics, calculators, engines, planes, whatever the man make, I am the original master plate. So my body has
represents a significant moment in American politics uh, that is divorced entirely of the economic uh, reality of